This video is going to show you how to quickly receive and ship a larger job across multiple trucks. We're going to begin with receiving the job. So to receive a job across multiple trucks, click receive. Firstly, fill out your truck information. Once you have all of your information filled in, enter your control number. This is going to tie your trucks together so that you can later consolidate all of these jobs into one. Next, all you're going to need to do is add the material that arrived on the first truck. The entire job is going to be 100 pieces of 2 and 3 8 J55 a round EUE. And we're going to receive 25 joints on each truck. So we add the 25, and now that you have your first 25 joints on the first truck, just right click somewhere on an empty area and select clone. This is going to copy over any information from the first truck to the second. Here, just add the next set of joints that was added onto this truck. and then repeat the process as many times as necessary. Once you've repeated this process as many times as necessary to bring in all the joints, all you'll need to do is hit complete on each truck to bring the inventory into your yard. Note that this process can be staggered out. If you're receiving the truck over a period of several days, then you can enter the first truck, clone it, and leave the second one open and empty until the next set of inventory arrives. The important part is this control number. Once you have all of your trucks ready to go, you can print a combined report of all of the trucks by clicking on the arrow next to print truck and choosing trucks by control number. This will show all of the jobs attached to the same control number on a single sheet. Now that you've received a set of pipe that needs to be combined into a single job, you'll just need to go through the consolidate process. We have a full video on consolidation, but for the purpose of completeness, I will show you a quick demonstration on this video. Click search for pipe. Find the inventory you would like consolidated and check the select box next to each of the jobs that need to be combined into one. Right click on any one of those jobs and select consolidate the selected jobs to this job. Follow the prompts and the jobs will be combined together into one, allowing for easier tracking. Lastly, I'm going to show you how to ship one job across multiple trucks. Simply click ship. Fill in your, your truck information. Just as you would fill in the information on your received trucks. Next, select add item. Locate the item that you would like to add to the truck. Double click on it. And when this screen appears, select transfer by bulk to only transfer a segment of the job. Then select transfer by joints or transfer by footage depending on your workflow. In this instance, we're going to be shipping out this 100 joint job on four trucks just as we received it. So select 25 joints. This will split 25 joints off of the base job and add it onto this truck. Once the job is on the truck, right click and clone, just as you would for a receive job. Then repeat the process until you reach your final truck. When you reach the final truck in the line, instead of selecting transfer by bulk, Simply select entire job slash tally in order to keep your records straight. 
Now that you have all of your trucks loaded, just like with the received trucks, you may click the drop down arrow next to print truck and select trucks by control number to print out another report for this shipment. Finally, make sure that you complete all of the trucks to remove the jobs from your inventory. And select complete jobs slash tallies now. And that is the process for receiving and shipping out large jobs across multiple trucks.